back, Coat Lords fans. Dum bum. We are here to do another trailer reaction for you. One that uh, we haven't seen yet, but we just love to just put it on, freestyle, watch it without. I, I think I think some some uh, reviewers and stuff they watch the trailer first, so they formulate their opinions, mm -hmm. right? And then they watch the trailer again, and then they're. They seem a lot more knowledgeable about it. We don't do that. We don't do that. We got a list of like 25 trailers <laughs> and we just click on them and watch them for the very first time. Going right raw. So we're gonna going commando on these trailers. We're raw dogging it. Is what we're we raw said. dogging it. Right. All right. So if you're new to the channel, uh, we like to put out movie reviews every Monday and then do trailer reactions throughout the rest of the week. So um, why don't you subscribe? Hey, doesn't take too much to yeah. click that button and hit subscribe and we'll be in your feed with, with the other subscriptions you got. And then uh, make sure to hit like. Uh, we need always to get double digit likes. And then tell us in the comments, is this a movie that you want to be watching when it comes out? So okay. well, you, it's you called, want, and you want us in your feed. We're very nutritious. Yes. So this is called Horizon and American Saga, Dane. Mm -hmm. with Kevin Costner. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm no, based on that alone, I'm going to guess it's a Western theme of some form or another. Well, he likes his Westerns. He's yeah. been in Dances with Wolves and Wyatt Earp. Waterworld. That's kind of Western. <laughs> I know. The Postman. That was kind of Westernish, Western right? Yeah, yeah he, so. he definitely likes his, his deep West, Montana, Wyoming, Utah. That Yellowstone, kind of right? Yeah. All right. Let's see what let's this do is. Let's do it. You and I are standing guard on one of the last great open spaces. Scenery. These people think they should tough enough, smart enough, mean enough. All this will be there someday. There's no army of this earth. Oh, Sam. It's going to stop those wagons coming. It's as they're wanted. Kevin Costner film. Hmm. Get as many of us as I can, mm -hmm. as far as I can. Is this a movie or a series? I've seen the exact same thing. I'd just like to have a drink and have a cigar and not have an act. You're not taking the full measure of this, Mary. I know the man I met was on his way to kill everyone in that house. No. He might as well have been walking up to get the mail for all that bothered him. What you build, they will burn down. that much this year? Haven't had much need of it yet. <laughs> Looks like we got ourselves a bad man right here. Mm. What channel? What is 
Shame on you. They're doing it only that way. in theaters. Wait, it said that only in theaters. Chapter one, chapter oh. He's going that direction. Chapter right? one, June twenty eighth. Chapter two, August sixteenth. Hmm. Wow. Can you go back a little bit more to where it brought the actor actresses in? Uh, Luke Wilson, Sienna Miller. That's who you were. Giovanni Rabisi, Jenna Malone, Abby Lee, Michelle Roker, Michael Roker. Mm -hmm. Annie Houston, Luke Wilson, Isabel Furman, Jeff Fahey. Jeff Fahey, I haven't seen him for a while. Owen Crowshoe. <laughs> yeah, remember, <laughs> we always talk about every time we see Jeff Fahey, we always show the the, the footage of him in Machete. Oh, yeah. As he pulls up and says, you want a job or whatever like that. <laughs> Get in. 125 for septic. Sewage. Have you ever killed anyone before? As you may know. We've done that like several times. Yeah, it's like the only like last movie yeah, he's ever been yeah. on that anyone remembers. Him I know. Oh, uh, so you know what? The person I thought I saw, Kim Dickens. You know who I'm talking about? I'll, when I see the picture. Oh, her. Yeah. From Fear. Yeah, uh, I, I thought it was her. I could see you thinking that too. Yeah, I did. I thought it was it, her. From that angle we were at, that was what we kind of thought. But yeah. yeah. No, it doesn't look like she's in this. So. No Kim Dickens. Yeah, no Kim Dickens. But, so, um, uh, I mean, you know, if you're into the Western genre of movies, if you love that. Which I do. Yeah, it's a huge, epic, far-reaching series. Well, and well, it looks like a series, it looks but it's like not. A, well, because it looks like there was so much to pack into a movie. Right. So, obviously, this is probably like, knowing Kevin Costner, these are probably like three-hour movies, two yeah. of them. So, you got six hours of content. <laughs> and he couldn't get the money for the streams. Yeah. <laughs> so, he's like, we're going in the theater. I want... I want to recoup. Yeah. So, well, uh, I mean, but you know what? Dances with Wolves, one of my all-time favorite movies. Yeah. So, um, and this looks very similar. Yeah. But that was A, based, based on a book. And B, I don't think he was the producer of that. He was just like, that was his big acting. Oh, he, he produced oh, that. Did he do that one? He oh, produced that was really early. We're talking like 1990. Yeah, but he produced it. Oh, so okay. Yeah, he was very involved in that. I don't think he directed it. But uh, he produced, that. yeah. So, or he was one of the producers, right. I should say. Yeah, I mean, I and I was, I didn't want to say anything. It was like always amazes me that there's still all this like wide open territory. I mean, if I'm assuming because it's him, he filmed it in the West, directed Dances with Wolves, directed by Kevin okay, Costner. So he directed it. Yeah, and um, he also produced it. So yeah, but yeah, it sounds like uh, it's kind of going back to the old West. <laughs> Yeah, America's amazing because, like, you know, I work with some uh, some British guys, and like when they come over and uh, you know, here I, I just was with them recently in Boston, and they were like taking like a couple weeks before they would go back to to the UK, mm -hmm. and they were gonna go to Las Vegas. Then they were going to go see the Grand Canyon. Mm -hmm. Then they were going to go to LA. And then I think that from LA, they were going to fly back, mm -hmm. but they were just like going, man, you guys just don't know how much land you have here in the United States compared to like European countries, you know? Oh yeah. I mean, and, you think about it, France is the size of Georgia. Yeah. I mean, yeah. It's country. It's uh, the yeah. size of Georgia. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, when you look from sea to shiny sea, we have so much land and so much like types of land you know what i mean you, you look at right. the bayous in louisiana to the you know the mesas the out in arizona the mountains in colorado you know the the swamps of georgia and north carolina and atlanta and pacific coast two yeah. different oceans on both sides it's just so different and then you got alaska and hawaii to, to boot well right You're right <laughs> so threw those in as as afterthoughts yeah so it's amazing so it's amazing to see this do you want to see this horizon uh i mean i yeah i would see it just to see but i mean i'm like i want to run not walk to this yeah. i want to see this so bad i know it's going to be good so well with this kind of cast yeah oh my gosh I mean, right <clears throat> but to your point they are going to be very long movies <laughs> so if it's good it's good
You know, like if it's a if it's a good movie, yeah, you can sit through three and a half hours of Oppenheimer. <laughs> you can sit through three Batman. and a half hours of, of Batman and three and a half hours of Lord of the Rings, uh, three in a row. You know what I mean? So yeah, with if, the extended editions with forty five minutes tagged out. I, hey, I've, I've watched <laughs> those extended editions, yeah. three of them in one day. Yeah. So, so I mean, it looks compelling. I mean, yeah. the, you know, the land is amazing. Obviously, there's going to be some serious serious drama oh yeah basically is another but it is one of those kind of movies of the homesteaders going out there and, and trying the to, indians and the indians and the, are right. what the heck are you doing on my land sucker we kind of saw a little bit of that in uh 1883 yeah did you watch that yet no oh, we're still God. we need to finish yellowstone yeah all i right. dropped my amazon prime for my paramount plus all right amazon well uh cold wars fans tell us what you think about this movie is this something you want to see are you excited to see it tell us down in the comments right after you hit subscribe and like and dane what do your horizons tell you well oh. go west young man Western movie. Okay. <laughs> Peace out, everybody. Go west.